Every day, JDI foresters look after six million acres of a complex forest community. They look after the whole ecosystem, including trees, wildlife, water, and soil in varied and diverse combinations. It's the trees, it's the water, it's the plants and animals, it's, it's the whole deal. Forest management at JDI involves much more than just growing trees and harvesting wood. John Gilbert is the Fish and Wildlife Manager for JDI. Every year, he helps stock salmon and trout from JDI's fish rearing facility at the Juniper Tree Nursery. Growing trees and growing fish. The interesting thing is that what you might not know, when you buy a roll of, of uh, uh, toilet tissue or facial tissue, uh, Majesta product, that uh, it's coming from a very responsibly managed forest. We're looking after the uh, water resource by doing the proper culvert installations and road building through to the uh, deer management and rare plants and then the replanting of trees. The story of forest management at JDI is all about continuous improvement, adapting and evolving with new knowledge from research and applied science. We've applied the same approach to uh, sort of science-based decision making on a whole range of topics from sea run brook trout to understanding rough grouse habitat to understanding how silviculture interacts with things like uh, mosses and, and, and other plants. It will be very rewarding for me um, to see all of that work, all that time, and all of the money that went into supporting this research put into something that's going to be easily used by Irving and, and maybe other woodlot owners. One of the questions we need an answer to right now is how do we protect these special cold water habitats in a very in a warming climate? Companies like J.D. Irving who are interested in the same questions uh, become very good collaborators with us. Sustainable forestry is a long-term commitment, and JDI foresters are recognized for their decisions today and for the future based on good science and continuing research. <laughs>